So friends, moving on to our next topic, which is HRU, hydrostatic release mechanism. Now hydrostatic release mechanism is present in the life rafts and EPUB. Now these units are connected with hydrostatic release mechanism. Now HRU is for the float free arrangement or the float free launch is by the uh, HRU, which happens. Now in life raft, what happens is when the ship goes down uh, below 1.5 meter to 4 meter, the HRU gets activated at 1.5 meter and within 4 meters, it releases the life raft. And then the life raft floats. The life raft is connected with the painter line. The painter line is linked to the weak link. Now, once the painter line is stretched, then what happens is the life raft uh, gets activated. The life raft opens. Once the life raft opens due to the buoyancy, it creates the weak link breaks and hence the life raft floats free to the surface. Now this, uh, the buoyancy which creates a uh, breaking strain of the weak link is 2.2 plus or minus 0.4 kilo knots. So this is when your uh, weak link breaks and uh, that is how your life raft gets operated. This is the float free uh, launch arrangement and uh, then the next important point is the breaking strength of the painter system with exception of weak link which is required is as follows shall not be less than 10 kN for uh, rafts carrying 9 persons and shall not be less than 7.5 kN for other rafts then comes the markings uh, present on the HRU the markings present are the HRU is permanently marked uh, on the exterior with its type and serial number as well as the date of manufacturing so these are the markings which are present on your HRU then comes your uh, EPUB. The EPUB is also connected with uh, HRU for uh, float free launch. And uh, here it is present with a, uh, a rope or a, a rope is there, a plastic, la, plastic latch, a rope or a string is present in, this, uh, in the HRU connected to the EPUB. Now uh, HRU is not fitted to the life rod which is present in the forward. Now there is a reason for that. Uh, to uh, to avoid the inadvertent activation of the HRU when the bow goes down uh, into the water and hence the HRU is not present for the forward life raft. So that is about the HRU and the expiration date. Now HRU are of two types. One is the one which has unlimited lifespan and other one is which is disposable type. Now HRU which is of disposable type has an expiry of two years and HRU which is of unlimited lifespan uh, shall be a uh, maintenance has to be done uh, 12 months from the date of manufacturing and 12 months from the date of servicing and in any case the period should not exceed five months in case of a delay which occurs so in case of due to some reason you are unable to uh, do the uh, servicing of your uh, HRU within 12 months then uh, extension period or the delay can be extended to five months but not beyond five months so that's the requirement for uh, servicing and expiry of the your HRUs. Now we'll be looking into the diagram also uh, in the further slides. Thank you. Friends, moving on to the diagram of hydrostatic release unit, it is as follows. Now this is your hydrostatic release unit. This is the weak link, this is the black link, this is secured to the deck, Now, this is the weak link which is red in color. There is another black link which is present which is black in color. This is your painter line.
this is the strong rope this is your hru so when a survey asks you asks you to make a diagram of the hru this is the diagram which you need to uh, draw hru the strong rope weak link black link which is uh, this is secured to the deck and the painter line now uh, you can do a extension of this also now the strong rope this goes over the this goes over your life raft and it is secured to the deck or the cradle which holds the life raft the painter line is attached to your life raft this is the this is the whole total uh, system and uh, the working is as follows when the uh, when your ship goes down to 1.5 meter to 4 meter at a depth of 1.5 meter the hru gets activated there is a knife which is present over here once the uh, hru gets activated uh, within 4 meters the knife uh, that the diaphragm is present over here which goes up due to the pressure once the diaphragm goes up the knife cuts the strong rope the strong rope once cut it will release the secured life raft the secured life raft starts moving up and uh, your painter line is stretched once the painter line is stretched enough the life raft gets activated and once the life raft is activated due to the buoyancy which it presents the weak link breaks uh, at a pressure of uh, the weak link breaks with a force of uh, 2.2 plus or minus 0.4 kN that is the breaking strength of your uh, weak link and uh, the life raft uh, uh, once the weak link breaks your uh, your painter line is also released once the painter line is released the life raft will float freely to the surface so this is how your uh, float free mechanism works and this is the hydrostatic release mechanism which is attached to your life raft